This is Australia's Northern Territory. It is a region found in the central and northern parts of the country. Now, the region isn't actually a state like, say, Queensland, New South Wales or South Australia, but in fact a territory, hence the name. Australia's territories aren't as independent as states. The federal government has more control over them, unlike states who control things like education and healthcare. So at 1.4 million kilometres squared, Australia's Northern Territory is gigantic. If it were its own country, it would rank as the 19th largest on Earth. Larger than countries like Peru and Chad, and in fact double the size of Myanmar. What's kind of crazy about this region is that its population is incredibly low, at just over a quarter of a million people. Again, if this region were its own country, this would rank them as the 175th most populated on Earth. What's even crazier about this region is that it doesn't even rank in the top 10 largest country subdivisions in the world. It just misses out in 11th place. But what exactly is a country subdivision? Well, the term refers to smaller regions or areas within a country that have a degree of administrative autonomy. These regions are typically created to manage local governance, resources and affairs. They can go by various names such as states, provinces or territories to name a few. So what are the 10 largest subdivisions on earth and how do they compare to the sizes of other countries from around the world? So starting off with number 10, we have Quebec of Canada. So at 1.5 million kilometers squared, the Canadian province of Quebec is the 10th largest country subdivision in the world. However, what's kind of nuts about this province is that it still isn't even the largest in Canada. To put this in perspective, 1.5 million kilometers squared is about the same size as Mongolia, the 18th largest country on the planet. The population of this province is some 8.5 million, giving a population density of just over 6 people per kilometer squared. This 8.5 million population ranks the province as the second most populated in the country. Ontario, the most populated, has a population some 60% greater. The capital of the state is Quebec City, and its larger city is Montreal. Number 9. Amazonas, Brazil The Brazilian state of Amazonas is found in the very northwestern part of the country. It covers a distance of some 1.5 million kilometers squared, some 17,000 kilometers squared larger than the province of Quebec. So again, roughly the size of Mongolia. The state is the largest in Brazil, and in fact the largest in the entire South American continent too. The state alone is larger than Chile, Paraguay and Uruguay combined. The population of this state is around 2.1 million people, so about a quarter of the population of that of our previous subdivision, Quebec. This gives us a population density of some 2.7 people per kilometer squared, making it an extremely sparsely populated region. The capital and largest city is Manaus, where just over half of the entire state lives. Number 8. Xinjiang, China Xinjiang is an autonomous region found in the northwest of the country. It is sandwiched in between East and Central Asia. And at 1.66 million kilometers squared, it is the largest subdivision in China. With a population of around 26 million, it is the most densely populated out of the top 10 largest country subdivisions, with a density of around 15 people per kilometer squared. That's about the same density as Oman or Paraguay. The capital and largest city is Urumqi, with a population of some 4 million the second most populated northwestern Chinese city, only behind the city of Xi'an. What's kind of crazy is that this subdivision accounts for less than 2% of China's total population, yet if it were its own country would rank as the 55th most populated, with a similar population to that of Australia. Number 7. Alaska in the United States At just over 1.7 million kilometers squared, Alaska ranks as the US's largest state. It is also the largest subdivision in the country, but not the continent. With a population of around 740,000, the state is extremely sparsely populated, with just 0.4 people per kilometer squared. 
This 740,000 or so people places the state as the third least populated in the country. Now, do you know what the capital of this state is? Well, the larger city is Anchorage, which is rather well known. However, it isn't the capital, as that belongs to Juneau. The population of the capital is only around 32,000, compared to Anchorage, whose population is more like 284,000. To put Alaska's size into perspective, it is some two and a half times larger than the US's second largest state, Texas, which is already gigantic. Again, for perspective, this is how Alaska compares to the size of Western Europe. Number 6. Queensland, Australia So as mentioned earlier, Australia is divided into six states and two territories, with Australia being the second largest in terms of size at 1.85 million kilometres squared. If Queensland decided that it had enough of being part of Australia and became its own country, it would rank as the 16th largest, larger than countries like Libya or Iran. The population of Queensland is around 5.2 million, giving a population density of around 2.8 people per kilometre squared. The largest and capital city of the state is Brisbane, where around half of the entire state lives. Number 5. Nunavut, Canada Ok, so this is where things start to get crazy. Nunavut in northern Canada covers a distance of some 2 million kilometres squared which would rank them as the 13th largest country on Earth, larger than Mexico or Indonesia. The population of this province is just 40,000, giving a density of around 0.02 people per kilometre squared. This makes it one of the most sparsely populated places anywhere on Earth. The capital and largest city is Iqaluit, where around 7,500 people call home, so about where 1 in 5 people in the province live. One of the most mesmerising facts about this province is the amount of islands it has. Estimates suggest some 36,000 or so in total, with the largest being Baffin Island, which in itself is over half a million kilometres squared, larger than mainland Spain. Number 4. Greenland, Denmark At 2.16 million kilometres squared, Greenland is of course Denmark's largest subdivision. The autonomous region is in fact some 50 times larger than Denmark itself. With a population of only around 56,000, it is considered the world's most sparsely populated country slash dependency, at just 0.03 people per kilometre squared. If Greenland were its own country, it would rank as the 12th largest, larger than Saudi Arabia. The capital and largest city is Nuuk, with a population of some 20,000. Now, depending on your definition, Nuuk could technically be the world's most northern capital city. Number 3. Krasnoyarsk Krai, Russia At 2.36 million kilometres squared, this region of Russia is known as a federal subject. It is so large that it is only ever so slightly smaller than the 10th largest country in the world, Algeria. Even with its unbelievable size, it is still not the largest subdivision in the country. The population of this region is some 2.8 million, giving a density of around 1.2 people per kilometre squared. The capital and largest city is Krasnoyarsk, whose population is just shy of 1.1 million. It is found in the southern part of the region, not too far from its border with Mongolia. Number 2. Western Australia, Australia Yet another mention for the Aussies, this time it's the country's westernmost state, which of course gave birth to its name. The state covers some 2.6 million kilometres squared, which now makes it larger than the 10th largest country on Earth. The population of the state is coincidentally around 2.6 million, the same as its size, which satisfyingly gives a population density of around one person per kilometre squared. The capital and largest city is of course Perth, where some 80% of the entire state lives. And finally, number 1. Saka, Russia so at 3 million kilometres squared, Saka is the world's largest country's subdivision, not to be confused with Arsenal's right winger. It is known as a republic. It is found in the northeast of Russia. So this 3 million kilometres squared would rank the republic as the 8th largest country on earth, larger than Argentina or Kazakhstan. 
The population of the region is only around a million, giving a population density of around 0.3 people per kilometer squared. So although extremely sparse, it's definitely not the most sparse out of all the regions mentioned today. The largest and capital city is Yakutsk, where around a third of the entire region lives. So there we have it, Saka of Russia is the world's largest country subdivision. If you can think of any other interesting country subdivisions, please do let us know in the comments. And as always, thank you very much for watching today's video.